Interesting. So here we go. We're coming out of our neighborhood. Um, this whole power grid or whatever we are has gone out completely. It, it's 10.45 It's 10. Yeah, we can even see the same. 10.46 p.m. Friday, September 12th. Pitch black, no cars on the road. Well, there's one way up there, but... The grid was destroyed, I guess, in our area yeah. or something. So so there, the the power gone. The neighbors have completely gone out of power. And the worst, the worst of the storm is still ahead. This is We haven't even gotten any rain yet. It looks like several of these neighborhoods lost power. Yeah, yeah, it does. Look at that whole Falcon Ranch. They all lost power. But up here, it looks like this the is street. this is like a huge area. This is a supermarket up here, Kroger. Looks like the other side of the 99. They've got lights. Oh it, no, it doesn't. Yeah, it does. You see the lights? Oh, okay. So it's only this side of the freeway that's out. Yeah. So it looks like this. The Kroger markets all that. Kroger, this is all out of power. Isn't that oh, weird? Here, yeah, yeah, it looks like up here they are some. You want me to go towards the school? Yeah, sure. This is our way towards my school. Yeah, yeah my school is up. And Lost yeah. and Terror looks like it's in good shape though, right? <laughs> what up here? The 99 freeway. It's right to Katie. Once again, that's, you know, 25 miles east of downtown. And so far, there's, we don't have rain. Yeah, it's just so, a lot of wind. Yeah, straw wind. We were just getting like probably 50 miles, 60 miles an hour gusts. You never see this completely empty freeway. Yeah. Oh, by the way, um, you know, over 50 miles an hour is gale force. Right. So gale force winds. This is uh, my high school. Yeah, the high school is fine, the Lost of Terror is fine. You can barely even break, see that it's a high school though, but it's so dark, but yeah. That's yeah, wherever those, those lights are, that's where the school is. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's a little shopping center, Lost of Terror. Completely lit up. <laughs> Interesting. It didn't look like the houses had light though. I know. So yeah, this is a... Well, actually, Pretty interesting. Okay. Yeah, they Lifetime still has light. Yeah, Lifetime's still at the fitness center. But they're locked up and closed. Why is our grid? Why do we not have grid? I think we're some of the only people without it. Hey, we're supposed to report. I just remember we're supposed to report outages to TXU. No, they said report it. I think we so are we're going down uh, the sometimes now, now more that I'm in the street. So my school is all right. Right there. No, it's not. It's lights on. No, they just th these. No, everyone's out of work. There's no one still working. Yeah, they just leave lights on for safety sorry, purposes. Cinco Ranch High School. Can't really see it. So Boarded up. Yeah. Stores over there. Junior High School. It's a sale show. Are y'all getting cooled off back there? Yeah, this is like all the air conditioning since the power is off in our house now. Yeah, the house is turning into a sauna. Yeah, the house the power's been off for how long? About two hours? Uh, an hour and a half? I think it died at about 9.30. <coughs> so, 9.30 it's about... Hour and 15. Hour and 15, so yeah. And it's starting to get hot in here. It is. At least we can charge our phones inside the air. Looks like Synchro Ranch is doing fine. They've got their power. Well, I don't know. I don't really see it from the houses. But oh, yeah, wait, yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fun. Yeah, so it's our, it's just our area that's being pretty badly powered. This is all like part of the community. I bet downtown Houston is probably all out. Probably, you would think that they got hit hard than us. Yeah. They probably got power out a while ago. They were saying in the news that like some of the cell phones weren't working either. No. Well, aren't we on, are we on the dirty side of the storm? I think we are. What? Oh. So we might get more, we might get harder hit. Yeah. Possibly. Yeah, you're right, Brianna. I think more wind is what she's saying. Stronger. It's um, 5.40 in the morning here. Um, it's pretty hard to go outside. The wind and rain is going crazy right now. From what I know, I believe the eyes have just gone over, Katie. So I'm going to try to get some footage. Wait, wait. 
hard I take on the part of this tree up front for it's crazy though. The wind is coming down really hard. It's kind of ridiculous and crazy right now. 540 in the morning, sorry, it's on the 13th. Um, I'm trying to go to the back. It's 550 right now. Uh, this is our back door. Can't really see much. It's just that there's wind and heavy, heavy rain outside. Really heavy rain. It's hard to get out there to film it. But the tree right here is going crazy. So are everybody else's. It looks like our neighbors, they don't, I don't see any lights coming from their house anymore. Yeah. So I don't know. Yeah. And now we've got some uh, like live uh, from the government, uh, this uh, the hurricane Noah. news. Noah. Yeah, from the Noah this is website. right now from the Noah website on the phone. Let's stop, stop it for a second. I mean, some difficulties. Yeah. Yeah, man, there it is. is. So. so the eye is going right over downtown Houston right now. Right? And it's heading towards us. Oh, so and like. we are just west, right about here. We are somewhere around this area. So that's what it's looking like right yeah. now. Yeah, I think it's like over us. Yeah, pretty much. At 5.30 in the morning. 5.30 in the morning. Mm -hmm. Here's a little more shot of the back door. It's about 6 right now. It's pretty loud out here. You can see the trees moving around a lot. Yeah. And I can't really walk out anymore because the rain is going crazy. But this is what it looks like right here. Again. Hey, somehow the radio went on all of a sudden. Did you did you flip it on? One of you? Uh, I'm pretty sure I turned that off earlier. Oh, that okay. wasn't the radio. That was the. That was the stereo. But anyways, yeah. Hey, Paul. Sorry to wake you up. Were you able to get that? Were you able to record that, Dad? Yeah, part of the. There it is. Oh, there it goes. It's again. Flashing again. You could see all. You could, I could see our neighbors going on too. <laughs> the whole area is being flipped on. Like those guys are out there trying to fix it. Center point guys must be actually out there trying to fix yeah, it or this according is according to what I was checking on here on the Cron website, Houston Chronicle on the phone, that one point three million people in the Houston area have out of power. So we're obviously not the only ones. <coughs> Galveston is inundated from the left and the right. Well, there's, somewhat. There's like five million people in the greater Houston area, so that's one fifth. Five and a half five and a half million that's, people. That's 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 pretty much one fifth. Yeah. Or a bit a bit um, a bit more than one fifth. 